uh, today we're going to be looking at a game that a viewer of mine uh, on YouTube uh, created in Python using Pygame. Uh, his screen name is Smart Viking. And uh, first off, let's just look at the game here. I'm going to start it up. Uh, it's a Python game. And uh, he was kind and used uh, all the music in the game is made by me from some music that I've uploaded to the internet. So this is the main screen once you start up the game. It asks you to enter an, uh, a screen name. By default, it will choose your username on the system you're running, but you can obviously change that. And hit enter to start it up, and it goes through some credits here explaining what is good and what is bad and the basic concept of the game. It's kind of like a Pong spaceship game. or Oh, it's not a spaceship, actually. I thought it was a spaceship at first. Um, but if you read the thing right here, you gotta keep the Chinese uh, rice farmer is from escaping the world to the west. Okay, uh, <laughs> kind of a weird plot, but um, let's go ahead and play a little bit here. So there he is, he's running back and forth, and I gotta put this little wall berry up and prevent him from going anywhere, and at the same time I can collect things that are flying around on the screen getting extra points. And the game will get faster and faster. And as we said earlier, uh, all the music is, is done by me. Two original songs by me and one cover of a Prodigy song, uh, Breathe. Uh, you can also, um, while playing the game, you can hit N on the keyboard to jump to the next song. So uh, I thank uh, Smart Viking for using my music, and I also thank him for sharing this game under the uh, GPL. The game is open source. Um, and uh, that's about it as far as the game goes. Very simple but fun. Let me escape to get out of that. Uh, you can also run the script with a dash dash credit argument, and it will. Oh, what did I, I spelled something wrong. Oh, credits. There we go, and we'll give you credits. Um, my name for the music, and I'll art by him. Coding by him. Uh, Static Safe and Robert, uh, I don't know how to say your last name, Mahil. Um, so, real quick, I guess the name of the game, I didn't even uh, mention that, I don't think yet. Crazy Chinese Pong, or cra Crazy China Pong is version 1.5. Um, and now let's look at where you can get that game. Uh, I got a lot of things open here. Oh, that's another tutorial I'm working on. Um, <laughs> Here we go. Right here is the website. Let's get that all into your view here if we can. I apologize. I should have set this up beforehand. And it's at GitHub. And um, I'll have the link in the description. Probably the best way to do this. But basically you can go here and you can, you can download uh, just a zip file uh, like so. And I don't know why that didn't download. There we go. It asks you if you want to download as a uh, tar uh, gzip or just a zip file. And it'll download and you can unzip it and run it. Um, I thank you for watching. And I hope that you have a great day. And once again, uh, just check this out. It's a fun little game.